Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this uh, screencast in which we are going to understand the foreign exchange quotations when they are represented in terms of bid and ask prices. For that purpose, we have this uh, forex quote with us, 0.0104-0108 dollars to a yen. And the first number in this quotation is the bid price and the second number that is 0 0.0108 is the ask price in terms of dollars. Um, for a yen. Let me at this point also indicate to you what is bid price and what is ask price. The bid price is the price that the dealer is willing to pay you when you have some foreign currency to sell and the ask price is the price that the foreign exchange dealer is going to charge you when you have some foreign currency to buy. So um, let us uh, focus at the denominator currency for a moment that is yens. If I want to buy yens, according to this quote, I will have to pay the asked price in terms of dollars, which is 0.0108 dollars. And if I have a yen to sell, my friends, then I'm going to get 0 .1, uh, 0 0.0104 dollars for it because this is the bid price. Let us uh, look at this scenario in the form of a table here to understand it better. I have written a sentence for you here. If I want to buy a yen, I am going to pay 0 0.0108 dollars for it. So let me indicate here that this number here represents the asked price for a yen. Now um, buying a yen my friends also means the same thing as selling a dollar. So in this uh, section of the table I am rewriting this sentence but in the reverse order. Rather than saying that I'm buying a yen, I'm saying that I'm selling a dollar. And if I do that, I am going to get the reciprocal of this number in return. So that is what I have written here. 1 over 0 0.0108 yens is what I'm going to get when I sell a dollar. So then in this format, this number 1 over 0 0.0108 is going to become the bid price for a dollar. So let us indicate that here. Bid price for a dollar. Now let us look at the second sentence in the first column of the table. If I want to sell a yen, I'm going to get the bid price for it, which is, point, uh, which is 0 0.0104, uh, which is this number here. And selling a yen, my friends, also means the same thing as buying a dollar. So alternatively, I can say that I'm buying a dollar. And if I do that, I'm going to be paying the price, which is going to be equal to the reciprocal of this number here. So that is why I have written here 1 over 0 0.0104 yens. That is the price I'm going to pay for buying a dollar. And since this is the price that I'm paying, I'm calling it the asked price for a dollar. So that is pretty simple so far. Now, if you realize, um, if you look at this quote here, 0 0.0104-0108 dollars to a yen, and if you want to rewrite the same quotation, but this time in the reverse order of the currencies, at the moment this quotation is in the form of dollars to a yen. If you want to rewrite the same thing um, in the format of yens to a dollar, what you are going to do here is you are going to first of all write the bid price for a dollar, which is this number here. So I copy it and paste it here. And then I'm going to put a dash. And after that, I'm going to write the ask price for a dollar, which is this number here. So I copy that and paste it at this place. After that, I write yens and then per dollar. So this becomes the same quotation, but in the reverse order of currencies. Let me give you a little tip here. If you look at the original quotation and the if you look at the asked price here, you will realize that the reciprocal of the asked price in this quotation becomes the bid price in this quotation. And the reciprocal of the bid price in this quotation becomes the asked price in this um, quotation. Now to give us some more practice, let us look at one more quotation and then try to write the reverse quotation for it. The quotation is 1.5670-1.5675 dollars to a pound. This means that if I want to buy a pound, I'm going to have to spend 1.5675 dollars for it. And if I have a pound to sell, I'm going to get 1.5675 zero dollars for it. If you want to write the uh, same quotation in the reverse format now that is in terms of pounds to a dollar, you're going to look at this number first 
and you are going to write the reciprocal here. So let me do that 1 over 1.5675. This is going to be the bid price now and then we are going to write a dash and then we are going to look at this number here and write the reciprocal of that here. So I am writing here 1 over 1.5670. This becomes my asked price in pounds for a dollar. So that then is pretty simple. I hope this was helpful for you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.